Forza Ornella! Grazie, eccomi qua! Hi, how are you? Lovely to meet you! Have a nice So we're here at 30th anniversary of Marcello. So Marcello, we said we've been here for the 10th, for the 25. No, not no. for the 10th, I'm sorry. For the 25th, for the 30th. 20, right. 25 and 30. 20, right? 20, 25 and 30. Yeah, wow. Every, wow. every, five, every five years. Every five years I'm here in this beautiful kitchen at Marcello's in Soffern. Okay, we said we have to do one recipe. Okay, well, come on. I, come I make, on. I make okay. you to work. So, Take some tagliolini. I tagliolini. Okay. One, two, three. How many? Yes. Why don't you put it into the water? Eh? It's a okay. salty water. It's a salty water. So That's we're going to do a very, very quick sauce, okay? Okay. Okay. Now, remember, this is a tagliolini with my name, <gasps> Marcello. chef. Me? See, Chef That's Marcello, so gourmet in Look at that. Now, okay. I love and also it. the tomato yeah. passata here. Okay, this is a, like an old beer uh, bottle. Bottle? But yeah. because in the United States, this is not going to work so good because it has a very low opening. Uh -huh. So yes. we are going to change it to a little bit bigger and with a little bit easy top, top. so easy to open. Okay, but look okay. how beautiful this sauce is. I know, you gave it to me and me and my daughter, we love it. We're going to take uh, just uh, one quarter of this bottle. Okay. Okay, that we're going to make it a very quick uh, tomato basil with a little bit of okay. garlic. Okay. Okay, and then we're going to finish with uh, burrata and a little bit of parmesan cheese. Okay. Okay, That's so what we do is we're going to just put a little extra virgin olive oil. Virgin olive oil, okay. Right here. Very little, very simple, okay? And we're going to <coughs> take some garlic over there. We don't even have to crush it, just to no. show how, how easy yeah, it is. Yeah, so one or two. Yeah, let's put Because two. we're going to remove it. After, yeah, let's right? put We can even leave it there. So that yeah. way at least the people see. Yes, right? you but know we, that is there. Right, but we don't even have to, like I said, crush it. If you want more flavor, you just crush it. Yes. You want to mince it, you mince it, okay? The garlic, it's a nice and golden. Yes. Now I, I shut it off, okay? Uh, what I'm going to do is, without being the fire, being that the... the what we want to do is we want to put the tomato in. Okay, it wasn't too bad. Okay? Like this, okay? Okay. Now, so we, we're taking a little bit of water from the pasta. From the pasta. And we put it in, just like that, okay? Because it's a, really, it's a dense sauce. Believe it or not, because of the olive oil and because of the tomato is so good, the only thing we have to do is add a pinch of black pepper if you can. Okay, yes, sir. I love that. And then a little bit of a pinch of salt, not too much. Okay. Because at the end, we're going to finish with the cheese. You know what I'm going to ask you? Yes. Something that probably people ask you. Mm -hmm. Did you add any sugar? No, 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 exactly. no, 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 no. Here there is nothing, and you should never add the sugar. Exactly, that's what I'm saying. Now, yeah. as you can see, the pasta, Yeah. okay, I don't even touch it. No, you we see? didn't do anything. Exactly. This is a, a whole wheat pasta, durum mm -hmm. wheat. Yes. Okay? of the highest quality, okay. made in an artisanal company in Calabria, a family that makes it easy. So and they have all, a tomb. Exactly, the, <laughs> old, the old fashioned way, okay, where they dry this pasta for eight, uh, I'm sorry, 30 hours. Wow. Okay, so, so now the sauce is ready to go, right? See? Yeah. They only put one quarter, not even, not even yeah. one quarter, and it's good for a full entree. Absolutely. So, so one bottle of this, uh, for four people, no problem. Okay. okay. You always have to try your pasta to make sure that there is enough salt, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, that, that's what a good chef is. Yes. Always taste it. You always know. taste it. And I'm taking this pasta now. And you're going to put right there. Exactly. So look. And uh, we're going to put a little bit of olive oil. Okay. Just a little bit. Okay. Finish. Then very easy. 
we're moving this mm -hmm. like this. Yeah. I want to show this to the camera too. Okay, so okay. now let me see how I embarrass myself from camera eating like that. Oh, you you, you wanna, know what? Let me why, do why extra. Why twisting a little bit more, right? Why don't you do more? Exactly. And believe it or not, you don't, you don't need a, a spoon, okay? Just blow in it, mm. right? Tomato and basil, you really don't need to put the Parmesan no, cheese. No, you don't. But most of American people like that. They so, like it. So let, let's because show you. Because we are in America, exactly. we show Exactly. Let me show you a little bit of cheese around here, like that. So you're no. mixing it up nicely. So you can do like that. Oh, okay. that's, that's more chef style. Okay. So we're yes, going to put sir. it into the plate like this. Okay. We take a little burrata that you can find in most of a delicate store. Right? Okay. Burrata, and we're going to put it right on top. Like this. Wow. Okay. So now the only thing they have to do is mixing the burrata that is, has a little bit of a stracciatella, a little bit of ricotta inside, mixing it up, and it's wonderful. So Brindiamo 30 years of success here at Marcello's. Bravo, Marcello. Auguri, Marcello. Uh, Grazie. There you go. Now, and I'm so impressed because you have your pretty face right here. <laughs> well, I, well, I thought if you wanted to market in something, you have to put your name because there's so uh, many, absolutely. there's so many companies outside you, you over have there. To personalize, you know, exactly. and you believe in this product. Yeah. If yeah. I do, listen, I, I didn't believe in the product, I will never put my name. So, you know why they are okay. lucky? Because you have been in this business for so many years as a chef, but also as an entrepreneur. You've been owner of this restaurant for 30 years. And so you know the market. You exactly. know who to sell to. This breadsticks, for example, okay. are made uh, three minutes away from five minutes away from my town. So That's this is so a, nice. probably the best breadstick. And uh, I love a breadstick. Yeah. It seems really yeah. artisanal. This is the panzerotti also. You know that Maybe. I'm going to shop later. I'm going to get everything here. <laughs> then we got so. also the amarillo. Yeah. Wild berry, uh, wild cherry, okay. Nice. Then we have the coconut here. Yes, I love yes. coconut with the tea, yeah. it's perfect. And so many other ones. Here, instead, we have from Casa Rinaldi. Um, they make a beautiful gift basket, a gift uh, yeah. a box. I choose about 12 spinach, spinach egg, uh, and tomato. And tomatoes. Okay, uh, I have a friend of mine that is uh, a, a manager from uh, the Pastificio Morelli. Very Ooh, I old love fashion. Okay, okay, and then yes. they make a beautiful package like uh, black pasta, the garlic and basil. I love this yeah, one. This is called foglio d'olivo. It's like a shape of an olive. You know what to remind me? Le orecchiette allungate. Eh, esatto. Right? Exactly. All the rest of the Terre del Sole from Casa Rinaldi, also a fettuccino with black truffle. The Busiati, the famous Busiati. I love the Busiati. Yeah. Yeah. Look how beautiful the peachy. Famous peachy. Yes. Okay. And we also have something interesting here. The penne with cocoa. What is the penne with cocoa? Yeah, like a chocolate. See? Ooh, with cacao. With cacao. Yeah. Wow, now this is like something that I definitely have to have it. And here is the best pistachio, okay, mm. from Sicily, pure, and then you can actually put on top of your toast or you can mix it with uh, uh, a pasta. I made a recipe about a while ago with the artichoke and garlic. Okay. I put this one here with some water, I cook the pasta, and then I add a little bit of a pistachio, and I did artichoke pistachio, and then into the sauce, I put a little bit of cherry tomatoes, a little bit red onions, then the artichokes, the water. At the end, I finish with pecorino and pistachio. Wow. By the way, amazing. on my YouTube, you have, all, you the, have all, the all the recipes. And you have a lot of different extra virgin olive oil as well. Yes. And I love this. Azienda Posterino. So cute, okay. easy to storage. <laughs> it's like the ortice from Campania. Yeah. And then the Terre Sacre also from the wine company that I represent also. And with, with everything the actually, we can say that everything, this passion of bringing a product from Italy started from the, uh, the wine, correct? Exactly, exactly. The wine we already started. I remember, so and let's then we go brought, see the wine. Exactly, right here. <laughs> look, how, look how beautiful this package here. I mean, it is beautiful. So how many different wines? Well, we have uh, six different wines. So okay. the famous Tintilia, 
Yes. Okay, yeah. over Molise. And I love also the bottles. So right. Very chic. Then we have a very nice uh, Montepulciano d'Abruzzo, but in, now they can call Montepulciano d'Abruzzo, it's called okay. Molise Rosso. Molise Rosso. Oh, and this okay. is a, um, a top of the line uh, also, 18 months in barrique. Okay. Then we have a called Nera Vite, Molise Rosso, only okay. six months in oak. One of the best rosé out of from Italy. Yeah. And then we have a Palanchina. And I love Palanchina too. This is a fully body, 14 nice. alcohol percentage, fully body. A Palanchina here, uh, top of the line, with one year in oak, similar to a Chardonnay to a in oak. Beautiful, nice. a Palanchina in oak, nobody makes it. Beautiful. Then we have Easy uh, Trebbiano. Okay. Here, that, that's an easy wine, also for uh, easy drink. If uh, you go in like this and you give it to some people, you put a bow here for it's Christmas. It's a Christmas. Now look how beautiful. Wow. Right? 30 years of Marcello in this big cake, but there is so much to say and maybe we'll say later. Very good. <laughs> I'm gonna